Hello, Dennis Gist here, and I am presenting to you a short history of the Australian Navy vessel, Castle Maine. This is a very short overview of HMAS Castle Maine's history. A more detailed account can be found on Wikipedia's website. When it became apparent that Nazi Germany was pinning our hopes on making the seas around Britain impassable for our supply ships, the Admiralty gave orders to every available British shipyard to build this new class of warship to counter the threat. And today, in ever-increasing numbers, new corvettes are going down the slipways. Castlemaine is an historic Royal Australian Navy corvette that served during World War II. Commissioned on July 17, 1942, the vessel played a crucial role in escorting convoys, protecting merchant shipping, and conducting anti-submarine warfare in the treacherous waters of the Pacific and Indian Oceans. One of the escorting warships has detected something on her anti-submarine instruments. This is where the corvette comes into her own. She was built for just such an occasion. And the vast explosions of her depth charges seal the fate of any U-boat in the vicinity. Castlemaine was one of 60 Australian-designed Bathurst-class corvettes built during the war. These corvettes were known for their durability and adaptability to various naval tasks. Castlemaine and her sisters demonstrated exceptional seaworthiness. The corvette saw active duty in the Pacific theater, escorting convoys and conducting patrols to counter the threat posed by Japanese submarines and aircraft. A message has just been flashed to warn us that hostile aircraft have been shadowing us and are now coming in to attack. Every man knows his essential function and gets about his job. Here the blighters come. Not many of them, but quite enough. Now you'll see what a bombing attack looks like at sea. That's typical of life in the corvettes. Many hours with nothing happening at all, and when it does, often nothing decisive to show for it. Except the one vital fact. The convoy gets through. One of its significant achievements was its involvement in the Battle of the Coral Sea in 1942, which was a pivotal naval engagement that thwarted Japanese advances in the Pacific region. Post-war, Castlemaine continued its service with the Royal Australian Navy. In 1945, the corvette was decommissioned, but was recommissioned in 1951 during the Korean War, which demonstrates its enduring qualities as a ship of war. The work of the corvette goes on, week in and week out, doing their vital bit to help win the battle of the seas for those nations that have pledged themselves to fight for freedom in this life and death struggle. In 1973, Castlemaine was decommissioned for the final time, marking the end of its naval service. I am Dennis Gist and smooth sailing to all.